Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the Bare Minimum Podcast. This week, we have a new crew with us. I'm now your new host, Cadence Coy, and here with me, I have Preston. Hola. Chloe Fall. Hi. Blair Hipsher. Hi. And Aubrey Smith, but she's in Guatemala right now, so we'll get back to her later. This week, we have a hot minute coming for you, two interviews, one with a high schooler and one with an elementary student, a sponsor, and then an ASMR minute, and some senior updates. She's alright! Let her get us on the ride, baby! Yeah! Hey, Katie, what do you think of garden gnomes? I like them. You like them? Alright, can you describe the color red without saying red? Paint, I don't know. <laughs> what time do you go to sleep at night? 9.30. 9.30? Man, what an early bird. What is your favorite cooked steak? So medium, medium rare. Rare. Well done. Well done. Like them crispy. How do you feel about mashed potatoes and ketchup? That's disgusting. <laughs> disgusting? Okay, do you have a weird food combination then? Um, chips and ketchup. Chips and ketchup? Ooh. All right, what is your favorite song or artist right now? Billie Eilish. Oh, the look-alike. The look-alike. Now we will be featuring our ASMR clip. First, we will have a whisper. Then we will have coloring on a page, flipping pages of a book, eating something, and tapping on the microphone. You are a wonderful person. Go Bears be rich, Mon. Woo. <laughs> Apologies, guys. That was the bloopers. Now we are going on to the real chip eating. I hope you enjoyed that ASMR session. Now we are going to go on to some senior updates. We have three seniors who have committed or have their plans for after high school. First, we have Laura Price. She is committed to Grace College. Wyatt Kramer has committed to Home Depot. Leif Traxel is to Bowling Green. And good luck to all of you in your future endeavors. We would just like to say a special thanks to Hayden Byers and Zachary Spearman, if you all could give a hey for helping us out. Hello. Hey. All right, thanks for the special feature. We will be now moving on to Ava. 
Now joining us, we have senior number five on the volleyball team, Ava Hobson. Ava, can you give us a hello? Hello. All right, we will be asking her some questions now. Okay, Ava, how long have you been playing volleyball? Um, I've been playing for about eight years. Okay. So what grade did you start then? In fifth grade. Okay. What is your best skill in volleyball? Um, probably back row passing. Okay, libero. <laughs> oh, yeah. Do you enjoy back row tacking? Do you even get to do that? <laughs> no, not really. I'm not really good at that. Do you like playing indoor volleyball or beach volleyball more, and why? I've never played beach volleyball, but I probably would enjoy indoor volleyball better because out Outdoor volleyball would be sweaty and the sand would get in your eyes. <laughs> yeah. Do you have any pre-game, pre-game rituals that you do before every game? This could be like for the team as well. No, not really, but before every game the team gets in the huddle and prays. Oh, that's sweet. What do you normally do when the volleyball season is over? <clears throat> um, in a couple weeks in, after the volleyball season, indoor track will start. And that's usually just practices. Do you, do you run, or is there anything else that you do there? No, we just run. Oh. Ugh. What other sports do you play? I also play track and softball. All right. Uh, last one. What advice do you have for the volleyball players tonight? Could be anything. Um, telling them to have fun, just anything. I would probably say just to have fun. All right, we have one last thing to say. Good luck tonight, Bears. Good luck tonight, Bears. Woo! Thank you, Ava, for joining us today. Thank you to our sponsor, the Hard Northern Library, and uh, our high school librarian, Mrs. Wilson, and our elementary librarian, Mrs. Hipsher. We appreciate everything you do. That's it for the Bear Minimum. Come back soon to listen to our next podcast. Thank you for listening, and go Bears!